Hello everyone, I'm meteorologist Vince Candela from Fox 6 in Milwaukee. This is our video weather notes for Monday, June 7th, 2010. Yesterday on Sunday we had some showers and thunderstorms in our area with some interesting hail. Hail forms as tiny little balls of ice go up and down within a thunderstorm, updraft and downdraft. They freeze, then a little bit of it melts as it goes down lower in the thunderstorm, then refreezes as it goes up higher. Eventually, that little ball of ice will reform and grow into a larger hailstone. The freezing line in a typical thunderstorm may be 15 to 18,000 feet above the ground, but updrafts can easily carry raindrops way above the freezing mark. They can then freeze there as little balls of ice, be forced back down, melt a little bit, then be forced back up above the freezing mark. Here's an interesting cross-section of a hailstone. You can see the individual lines here where the hailstone melts a little bit, then refreezes and melts and refreezes and grows, like the growth rings on a tree. In this photo from Adam, one of the weather watchers for the National Weather Service, you can see an interesting shape here. This is a, a stone that fell near West Bend near his home, and you can see little spikes sticking out from the tiny hailstones right in the center. Here's another example of that, this time with a photo from Steve, another observer for the National Weather Service. There's the central, what we would think of as the common hailstone, and then you see these little spikes that appear to emanate from the hailstone itself. They weren't all that large in size, as you can see, but nonetheless, very interesting shapes here. Now, these interesting shapes of hail that formed... Uh, yesterday, uh, Sunday, uh, June 6th, may have formed because of multiple uh, small hail stones uh, attaching to each other. And as they did so, they grew these very interesting and unusual shapes. So it's not the kind of thing that we see every day here in southeast Wisconsin, but certainly uh, noteworthy nonetheless. Thanks for watching the video Weather Notes. Hope to see you on Fox 6 News.